Now, after that initial assessment was conducted in Grand Bahama, there was one conducted in Long Island, and Prime Minister Christie, alongside NEMA officials and the island administrator, identified a number of low-lying areas on the island which are vulnerable to flooding. Mr. Christie says the Disaster Preparedness Act seeks to protect Bahamans living in these areas during and after the storm. The Disaster Preparedness Act actually stipulates that we should, in fact, look for these areas and protect them. Um, I was just indicating um, earlier today that we had a loss of life in Queens Cove in, in um, the Freeport area, where someone was asked to leave, didn't leave, and the, the sea just kept on rising and um, up to four feet and above. Um, and and the, the point is, we know every hurricane that happens. And so do we allow people to stay in? Do we amend the law to make mandatory um, evacuations? Um, the order of the day. And so, <clears throat> because forever and forever, we're going to be a chain of islands. And I think from a budgetary point of view, we must do our best to protect the Bahamian public by identifying areas and on an incremental basis in each budget, make allocations so that we can actually know um, that we're able to measure the work we do in this regard. Because we're going to keep on coming out here year after year after year watching the same thing happens. Meantime, Mr. Christie says while it may be costly on the family islands to purchase land and build homes on higher ground, it's something residents living in Long Island should consider. And it is more expensive to build roads higher up. As you can see, graveyards and <coughs> roads were built along the shore. And that's because it was cheaper and easier um, to do it that way. Um, but they are, it makes it more vulnerable, and that is why you find that we have to pay so much um, um, when these disasters take place. Um, and um, the question will be, when we have to make decisions, whether we can make decisions on the basis of future potential occurrences and therefore you make a decision that might cost you more.